Hello everyone, so today, for one of my first videos on YouTube, I figured I'd talk about probably the most simple and probably one of the most useful troubleshooting techniques that I've used in the field. Um, you won't use it all the time, but I mean, it's it's ba it's basic. It's finding if something is open or closed, um, and it's basically just ohming out a cable. So for this experiment, all we're going to need is basically a piece of wire like this and a multimeter all right so let's say you're in the field and you're trying to figure out if something is if a wire is chewed or something like that because like where i work inside substations and stuff sometimes mice get inside of the they I mean they're, they're not supposed to but they get inside of the the wireways and they chew up stuff and I'll go in there every once in a while and I'll have to ohm out cables to figure out what's actually broken and then run more cable. So this is basically how to figure out if something is opened or closed. So what you need is a multimeter right here set to ohms. And sometimes they have a sound thing. Um, you can turn it off or on. I'm turning mine on so that you can actually hear it. And basically what we're going to do is this is to test to see if it's closed. All right. So we just set up our two leads. It's really simple. And as you can see, it's making a sound. It shouldn't be like that. It should make a solid sound. Let me see if I can set this up right here. There we go. Let me wrap these wires around here. So to get a solid sound, I had to wrap the wires around. But as you can see, it's definitely closed. Now, to see if something is broken, when you do this, instead of making that noise, it'll do this. It'll be nothing. And if you know that those wires are supposed to, you know, be closed and be making contact, it'll make a sound, and if not, it won't. So, that's basic troubleshooting 101. Uh, it's probably come in handy more than I can count. I've used it on everything from power generation to substation use or whatever. So, that's uh first video on YouTube that's actually useful for me. Please subscribe. Thanks, guys.